Uh, so this is the offer here. You get a £200 bonus if you can switch your current account to RBS and you need to deposit £1,250 into your account and log into the banking app within the first 60 days of opening your account. And if you can do that, you will meet the conditions and you'll get £200 paid into your account within one week. Um, there is also the uh, terms and conditions here, which I recommend you have a quick look through to make sure you're able to receive the offer. Um, and you click on here, switch here. Uh, whether you have a Royal Bank account already or not, because this offer is open to existing account holders and new account holders at RBS. It's worth noting how the bank account switching works. Now, when you apply to RBS, you provide them with the details of the account that you want to switch over. Um, and then from here, RBS will get in contact with this bank to begin the switch. Uh, it says you'll be kept up to date throughout. Your old account will be closed. Any funds and any payments will be moved to your new Royal Bank account. And then they'll let you know at the end when it's all done. Now it's worth saying here that it's probably better to use a second current account and not your main current account with all your payments, direct debits and whatnot coming out of it. Although it is a pretty seamless process, you just never know. So I recommend having like a burner account or a second backup account as the one that you use for doing this switch. And then we go down here, we have to choose our bank account. Our it's best to go with the everyday bank account, where, which I believe is the uh, yeah select account. Now uh, just some more eligibility stuff here, uh, 18 or over and a UK resident. Uh, just stuff about information. How your information might be used and then we can continue uh, I'm going to open our sole select account just in my name um, for me I used to have an RBS account and uh, no not for me From here on, you just need to provide all the normal sort of details that are asked for when opening a bank account, name, address, email, phone number, and that kind of thing. I'll skip this part as I don't want to dox myself on the internet, so I'll pick the video back up on number two here, which is identity verification. At this stage, RBS hand this over to their partner, who you, so I'll uh, resume the video when I'm doing that part. After we've provided RBS with all our details, the final step is to verify our ID. Uh, to do that, we'll need photo ID, so that could be passport or driving license. And then we need to do a liveness check where they compare your face to that on your ID. Uh, so we'll just go ahead and do that now. Uh, just a privacy statement from who you, the partner that RBS used for this. Uh, so it's pretty straightforward. Um, you can either do this on your phone or do it on your computer. Uh, I think what I did before was I did the liveness check on my computer and then to provide my ID, I went across to my phone, so I'll try and show how to do that here. Uh, yeah, so just click through on the ID and the ID that I want to use, and then you can click on this here to continue on mobile phone. Uh, you just put your phone number in, 
and they'll send you a link so you can open up this page on your phone and then continue to take the photos of your ID and submit them to who you and I'll try and go back from here and the other part is the liveness check where you just need to take a video of yourself and follow the instructions that they provide uh, I won't do it on the video here obviously for obvious reasons but uh, I think that is everything so once all that is done uh, you should get your identity verified and then you just need to wait a few days and RBS will confirm that your account has been created and then from there you need to uh, deposit the 1250 into your account uh, download the mobile app use the mobile app and within a week you should have your 200 pound bonus deposited into your RBS account 